snow really bad but I guess it didn't well I guess I jinxed it it's starting to snow now so there she is I'm still gonna try to pull her in and work on her later put the moldings on the door I got the hatch in the garage um, to take the molding out you have to take this uh, this molding piece here off it's pretty easy a lot of people tend to pull on these and then they end up breaking them there's actually a, a screw here, and a screw there, and a screw back here, and it just comes right off. And then uh, this, uh, this one was already kind of like apart from the clip area, so I just slid it right out from under here. I'm gonna try to mount the new one the same way. Hopefully I don't fail and break a clip, but there's a difference. Old, new, so big difference. Every detail counts. Well, there was no other way around it. I had to take the door panel off because it didn't want to come up. Uh, when I wanted to put the, the new molding in, it didn't want to come through here without the clip hitting the, the door. But I got it switched, so check that out. Brand new. I'm gonna put the molding on so you can see it better. So I got the door panel back on. I was gonna show you how it looks while the molding's on, so it looks like one solid piece on the door, but as I was tightening this one here, it snapped off, which I'm a little disappointed. But we do have uh, some type of JB Weld looking stuff. So we kind of like filled it up. I'm gonna let it dry so that way I can put it back on. It doesn't look, it doesn't look horrible like this. <laughs> wow, look how much cleaner that looks. Oh boy. The reason why I have yellow tape here is because there's holes here. And since I have those pieces uh, drying up with the, the JB Weld I think we put on there, uh, I put tape on both sides so the water doesn't get in the door and rust the bottom of the doors, you know. I do have a little rust there and some there. I'm trying to avoid all that rust issue, so. Look how clean that looks, boy. Does everything match? Black, black, front lip black. Oh, I feel like getting black wheels, I don't know yet. Well, there you go. It looks fucking good with that <laughs> brand new molding. Oh, I can't get over how good. I almost got rid of the wheels. I don't think I'm gonna get rid of them. I'm just gonna hang on to them. I don't wanna kill the life on the hatch. But both moldings are on. It looks fucking great. I also have another problem with the hatch. I don't know if you guys remember that the heater blower was making that weird noise. It finally gave out on me. I have it right here with me. I did order a new motor, so it should be here sometime Friday, I think. I don't know. I have to check the shipping info. But I'm trying to get it in before that car meet. I think it's on Saturday. Is it on Saturday, babe? Yeah, it's on Saturday. So I'm trying to get the heater blow in for Saturday because I'm not trying to freeze my balls. It's going to be a, like 40-ish degrees. Let me show you. Let me show you. So see, I got the blower out here, and I have the AC part somewhere in there. Right there, as you can see it. Uh, just the motor went bad, so um, the motor should be coming in soon. Put it in, and then I'll have heat. I also have 2,000 fog lights that a friend of mine gave me. I was planning on uh, painting these black to cover the, the holes that I have there for now until I boost the car, because I am going single cam turbo. And yeah, I don't know. I really don't know what to do yet. Time will tell. So it's been a couple of days and I still haven't got my blower in the mail, which I'm kind of upset because it's still a little cold outside and I don't have heat in my car and they haven't shipped it out yet. But today I got something in the mail. I wanted to show you guys Full Bangers production, you know, showing them some love and I like his keychain thing. So let me open it up and show you what it is. So right off the bag, the first thing I pulled out is this cool looking card, Full Bangers production. You know, saying thank you. Uh, go check him out. He has a lot of content of car stuff, car shows, and he has a nice yellow Integra Type R. 
And, uh, and right here, dual pool. Reads backwards on my screen. It's pretty cool. I'll put this on my keychain. Thanks a lot, brother. Showing you some support. And maybe I'll do a pool in this video. I don't know yet. <laughs> it's a single cam, so I don't think I could do a pool. So it's time to retire this one. I got this one at H Day about two years ago, I think. Two, three years ago, I got this at H Day. So time to retire this one. It's too long. It gets stuck when I sit in the car. I get, get punched under my leg. So I didn't want nothing too crazy like this of a lanyard. But yeah, that's all I have for now. Uh, tomorrow I'm going to uh, going to two events. One is uh, uh, the effing send it meet. I'll record that. And that's not till Saturday night. And tomorrow morning, I'm going to uh, support one of my co-workers from work. Uh, he's into like this dirt racing type thing. Um, I'll get some footage of that. I mean, I know it's not Honda related, but it's pretty cool stuff. Uh, I'll show you guys tomorrow. But thanks for watching my video. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one. Peace.